we have the Imperials this year, uh, who was the, the, the ones who were on the cutting edge of contemporary. And the contemporary uh, is now, uh, it's not as mainstream as it was back in the uh, 70s and 80s and 90s, but uh, uh, we have this year, we have featured uh, J.D. Sumner and the Stamps, a, a group of those guys who were members of J.D. Sumner and the Stamps will be joining us. For me. We have a reunion of the Singing Americans, and that is exciting to me. The Singing Americans uh, were at the top of the game back in the 80s. And uh, in that group, we have Ed Hill and Dwayne Burke, Scott Whitener, and Danny Funderburg singing tenor. And he's very well known uh, with, with his years with the Cathedral Quartet. He became very well known, and he, he's still a great singer. Uh, we have uh, Jerry and the Singing Goths is going to be with us in a reunion this year. And Jerry uh, is 78 years old. Maybe I shouldn't be telling that, but he's still amazing, and he, he loves gospel music. Uh, and Bill Dykes and Tank Tackett will be singing with him at that reunion. When I am blue, I am blue. We have a reunion of a group that was started in 1959 by Ed Hill, the Prophets Quartet. They were really mainstream. Uh, as a matter of fact, I think they changed the face of a lot of, of, of uh, gospel music back in the day. Some people seem to get so near it, they turn him down. Judgment 